It's two days to my birthday. Welcome again to my channel. It's two days to my birthday. Why are we always excited about birthdays, guys? Why? You know, for me, it's just another opportunity to be grateful, thankful. It's not everybody that wants to see another year that gets to see it, guys. And as much as we don't want to fuss about it, we have to fuss about it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm excited and I did something different this year. As a YouTuber, there are other things that I need for my gear to, you know, be able to give you good content and be able to vlog here and there. There are some gadgets that I wanted. Some are not expensive, some are expensive. And I'll put them on my Amazon list. And typical of birthdays, you know, friends give you things. And I just thought about it and I said, look, there are particular things that I really want and I want those things and it's a good opportunity for me it's my birthday to request those things for my friends you know tell them that if you want to give me something for my birthday these are the things that are on my list so that you can just give me what I want rather than buy me shoe or buy me bag they are good though but they are not requirements for me for now you get what I'm saying? So I decided to go on Amazon and create an Amazon list, you know, like a registry, so that I can share the link with my friends, even my enemies, so that they can get me something for my birthday. And it worked. So from my list, you can take a look at the things that I wanted or I have put in my registry list. They are all vlogging kits vlogging kit in fact one of my friends said ah for luck you will not change you live vlogging sha i said what can a girl do so i decided to put all these things in my kit in fact at a point i was still adding because people were picking the chuchu ones they didn't want to pay so much but i get it at least an opportunity for me to spend money on the ones that are expensive myself at least those small small ones those cheap cheap ones I'm taking them off my cart by my goody friends that have been able to pick good things for me for my birthday and this is two days to my birthday I've been having gifts delivered to my house so what I did was also to set my address as delivery location so that I'll be able to get the items delivered to my house rather than you know getting it to your friends house and bringing it i shall want it early my birthday is on the second i want to unbox all of those gifts you know when i'm going to air this video so i'm going to wait i've not opened the gift and i'm not going to open it my initial plan was to open it on my birthday hopefully i get everything in so i want to unbox everything once so that you all see what I order. These are all the things that I want and those are the things that I requested from my friends to buy for me. So, do you like this idea of you getting what you want for an occasion? It doesn't have to be birthdays alone. It can be any occasion. Maybe you have a graduation, you have a baby, you have a housewarming. And I wonder why I didn't read during my housewarming. Although my friends knew me and they actually got me some interior things. They know I'm also an interior decorator. Most of the gifts that I got were home things and some also showed me before they bought it but they all tried they all got me good things for the house and they were all very useful indeed so I appreciate all my friends these are practices that we do for ourselves you know that's why friends community is good even people find why like the Amazon wish um, registry list it's good because you don't have to have friends that are close to you some cannot even come visit you or yeah you know send gifts to you because yeah they don't stay in the city but they are your friends they can 
use this Amazon registry to be able to send gifts to you. What they need to do is just to follow the link where you share your link with them and um, your gift is purchased. So as I get an alert from my email telling me another gift has been bought, another gift has been bought and I was counting my gifts. It was so exciting to know that all these items have been picked by my friends and trust me I was peeping unless they are because it's also happening on the Sunday it's going to be a good time to celebrate as well in church on Sunday uh, we also have a family member in church that his birthday is also on Sunday so it will be good to celebrate at least and I've brought out a big turkey for my friends that are also visiting me I've said look all of them, they always want to eat jollof rice. And I said, well, you know, people should just look at something different. If there's no jollof rice, you eat something else. So my plan actually, because I'm, I still am not sure, but I know that one of my friends might cook jollof rice and bring. She doesn't talk, but she performs. So I expect jollof rice from that angle. And um, the big turkey that I already brought out to grill, I'm going to... My car is not moving, even on, on cruise. Alright, so I brought out the turkey to marinate and I'm going to grill a whole turkey. This is just me starting off this vlog and telling you that I'm hippy hippy happy. Happy it's birthday for me and happy to celebrate. Being alive, God has been faithful, it's been blessings over blessings. Yes trying times come your way but you know the bible has said we should rejoice and again i say rejoice we should rejoice continuously and one thing i also realize that when trying times come your way it's not it's not for you to feel gloomy it's not for you to feel that you know heaven and earth has fallen on your head but just to appreciate god because those things come to remind you that god is awesome god is faithful because if you do things within your power you achieve everything things begin to go boom 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 you feel that it is by your strength and you want to neglect god but god uses those situations to reiterate that i am the one in charge guys just catching up starting the vlog this way and let's see how he ends so keep watching i'm home guys let me show you what i have received for now let's go so this is the registry and gift list so if i scroll down you can see here i have two days to go for my birthday and i put in about 15 gift items i have eight already purchased as of today and i put them in my blogging kit i have other um, tags for my other things that I want but this is the one for my blogging kit which is 15 items so you can see a few of the things that I wanted to buy for myself and um, right I've been able to get some of these things purchased by my friend so these are the things left on purchased these are the ones that have been purchased that have been marked purchased and these are all gift items for vlogging i'm just heading out it's saturday look at this doggy 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 in fact i'm so excited for this new weather that we're getting into although the weather is um really not stable the weather is not stable it's just been giving us different vibes different vibes different vibes but we are hopeful that we will be we are officially in spring but we are hopeful that we will be physically in spring if you get what i mean because the weather has really been showing us pepe minus one well it's been good in fact i had a family that went to ontario and guys they have been already off winter since because somehow in fact she was saying that everywhere was clear there was no inch of snow anywhere in fact we are in the remote area guys you want to come to saskatoon yes we have snow waiting for you 
but it's a good place even though snow never ends but i'm sure very soon with our sunlight that never stops shining and no more snow falling we should be able to have everything melt by the end of april i will show you a picture trust me i am giving my word for the snow <laughs> in saskatoon so believe it or not we will have a good weather for us to be able to enjoy ourselves so saturday morning i have a meeting at the bank yes our bank open here on weekend physical so we are our bank open physical on weekend because saskatoon or canada has a 24-hour work culture so most of those that probably work during the weekends have had their off days during the week so it's 24 hours you can find someone there i'm not sure if they actually open on sundays i think they don't but saturdays yes life is happening around in saskatoon so i have a meeting in fact i have a lot of places to go to different places i'll just take you around a bit you like going around for so guys don't let me bore you and let me focus oh my god okay i'm still on track <laughs> that's what happens when i'm vlogging in the car i almost just get into the groove and forget where i'm driving to you know the other day i missed my way when i was starting the new job don't let this happen i'll catch you up later guys love you so the weather is not too bad after all i decided to take off my jacket and go into little no, where am I? Center Mall actually. I'm in Center Mall. So let's go there together guys. So I'm going into Center Mall right now. So I'm actually in the jewelry store where I they actually help me to change my batteries phone batteries whenever i have phone battery issues you know batteries are not cheap like nigeria when you want to change your batteries so i come here and i have you that is always my body to go to he does a good job for me i also have a belt for my husband that needs some holes in it so i brought those two here for some adjustments so I'm done at the jewelry store and I want to enter Dollarama for some quick items to pick up. I forgot my bag in the car. I'm not buying bag. I'm going to take it. So I'm just done in Dollarama as well. Still waiting to pick up my wristwatch and the, the belt. But I got some stuff. And I want to drop them in the car and come back, sit in. That's the best I can do for now. I didn't want to go and come back, so the only option is for me to wait. So I have to wait. Right, so I still have a bit of more errands to go for. I have my list, so I don't miss out. Sometimes you trust this brain so much that I can keep everything. I was actually going to share how i keep my grocery list you know i have an app that i use that helps me you know it's a productivity tool it's notion and i use it really religiously honestly it's helped me to be productive in the things that i want to do beyond shopping too even on so many grounds you can have productivity tools for your life for your home for your business for your work everything and compass and you can find things i've been using notion for over a year now and i can attest to you that i have been more productive than i used to working now <laughs> this is working now you didn't correct the time for me it is the correct time 10 after 2 well it's okay. after 2 hello yeah. hello <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Bill and I know how to catch ourselves. <laughs> so I'm back home, guys. My battery died. Unfortunately, I couldn't take you around all the other places that I went to that I promised. But basically, I just went around, basically around 8th Street after the bank. I went to Sobeys, I went to Center Mall. 
after that i my battery died and then i went to market more i needed to pick up my medication and pick a few things from another grocery store there yeah and i came back home so that's basically and i've been grilling the turkey let me show you guys i've been grilling the turkey and it's it is cooking yeah so that's how my day has been today pre-birthday the birthday guilt has not rested since morning kai i need a chef that will make breakfast lunch and dinner for me please if you're a chef put in the description book and let's talk birthday girl birthday girl birthday girl birthday girl so guys today is my birthday and because there's church after preparing some food yesterday i decided to quickly make some moi moi this morning so that that will be ready before we arrive or even leave for church and then we'll have solidified before people come in in the afternoon so let me show you just the process guys because time is time time is what because time is running out so i'm just doing this really quickly so this is moi moi in the making and this is my biggie pot ready to absorb my moi moi so catch you later guys Let's just unbox this one, the last one we came, right? Let's do that together and the cable that I'll use to extend my microphone if I have a lengthy um, distance between my camera and my maybe where I'm sitting now. So this is useful. I have one that I use currently. Let me show you. This is my camera. I use the Sony TV one. And if I take off this first shoe that came with my camera, usually I would attach this here. And this connects to this piece. And this is just a distance. So if I'm staying far away and my camera is far, it's difficult for me to get you know, what I want in audio. But this particular one, that podcast vibe, you know, 
my mic will be in here. This is like the cover. And this goes on my desk. So I can install this, have this on my desktop, on my table rather, and extend, you know, this. So this works like an extension to my USB port. If you see this, then I have multiple spaces to be plug this into my computer, and then I have multiple areas whereby I can plug my flash drive, my memory card, you know, and all other extensions that I need. Because sometimes when I have my must, uh, memory card plugged in, I can't do anything else. It takes space. I have flash and memory card. And that takes like the space. I can't edit something or sometimes I want to edit another video while I see how one. Otherwise, if I take it out, I've messed up my whole editing game. So the next one is my two terabyte SSD card or backup rather. So I had I used to have one that fell. That was back in Nigeria. But I need something that I can move my recorded um, vlogs into while I edit and clear space in my memory card to keep vlogging again. So this will do it. This is very portable, really small, pocket friendly, purse friendly, you know, and makes life easy. Then I can move it and it's two terabytes. So it takes a lot of space. And this is going to also make editing easy or storage easy for me while I am blocked. so in this I got two gifts and I know who gave me these two beautiful gifts so this is my what's the call now I don't like this let's open it oh, oh yeah I remember this this is one you know it's like an extension this part of my camera where my horseshoe going to or my wind breaker when I'm vlogging and where I can also extend to put in my um, maybe light if I want to but this also works like same you know this is also an extension for something like this but I actually still need something like a gear which nobody picked from my list you know like a a, a covering for my camera that helps me install this so that i'm going to get myself whether i can screw this on it and have an extended version of this here also have yeah so this these are the additional extensions that go into the camera i'm going to show you a bit. so this This goes, you know, it's like the way I just removed my my uh, microphone. This also goes, you can put this as an extension here. So this is, and then I lock it up. Then I can still have all my other gear, you know, to have this extension used. So this, I can still have my wind mount windbreaker can come on this side like so i can actually do this and then still use this for my lights still use this for other purposes you know i'm able to extend um you know just additional gear on my phone and then i have it all initially it was just that one space that is here that is not making me have the ability to do so many things on the gear so i still have to get that here yeah, for the camera and then now start fixing all of this on it. So this was actually gotten for me by my twin brother. I only sent him when we were talking. He was actually the day to my birthday because we were chatting and I was telling him about what I did and I shared it with him to take a look at everything and then before I got to bed that night I saw a message on my email saying somebody bought a gift and then I went snooping 
to find out good and I saw it was him and I said oh, I wasn't going to bug you to buy one but this also helps me you know without gear everything still comes back to the gear on the phone you know that bracket that holds the phone and this helps me move my phone uh, my sorry I said for the camera helps me move my camera around if I just want to you know look instead of holding it like so then I can do this if I am actually vlogging around. So this is like the hand it's a small ring for and one more as we go on. So yes. This is a memory card. I needed a bigger one because what I have it what I had was a 64 gig. In fact I had two 64 gig which wasn't helping me. Usually it would have been nice for me to have it in one, so I needed something bigger for space as well. If I was going to store for my, if I'm filming and storing in my memory card, this would be better than me having two small ones. For some repacks, they are gifts, like I said, this is my camera pouch. So now I can have my camera. Let me take this out as well. My camera stored nicely in the pouch safely so this is going to be safe and it's easy to move around all of this yeah this is another holder to my camera this in fact this is the one that holds my power bank you know so i can extend this you know have this screwed up on my camera you know this still has to do with all my gadgets that i talked about okay so this goes somewhere behind and i can put my power back. okay so i have to extend it open this up and when this goes in there then i can lock it up And like I still said, it's still hinged on and it's secure. It's still hinged on the brackets that should be going on this. Then I can screw this on it and it holds this for me while I vlog. Oh, look at that. You wanna steal it? This is nice. This is a makeup mirror. I had one that I got that lights up. I think it's LED. You touch it like this. I bought it from China before I came to Canada. But somehow along the way, I don't know what happened. Maybe it's the charger or I shall miss something sharp. So that wasn't. Um, I just put it as a temple. Where is it? Hidden somewhere. But this is also nice. I know my daughter was still. She's somewhere around today. Looking at me like. Are you going to do it? Oh, but, um, well, one of the friends that still gave me one of these gave me this scroll. Thank you, Dior. Thank you so much. And she sent me a beautiful birthday card. A Floki with the large heart, a warm and delightful, bright, kind, a, a warm and delightfully bright kind of birthday. The right kind of birthday for someone like you. Best wishes. This is uh, another, this is actually a shawl or something for spring. I like the floral, so it's just something you wear that can over. Like this. And it's really nice. What do you think, guys? Okay, so we're going to conclude the video this way without taking this off. Oh, did I wear it wrongly? Uh huh? Uh huh? I think I wore it wrongly. Let me. Okay, because of this. Hmm. Yeah. So now let me wait the right way. So this is how it is.
floral for the spring. So this is really nice. Thank you to everyone that has gifted. Who gives them this wonderful gear to help make vlogging experience with delight. Thank you so much from my heart, from the Plukis then team, from the backend team, that's my family. They are sending their well wishes and their thanks for all these gifts and we won't disappoint you guys, don't worry. We will not disappoint you. We will be giving you as you want it, okay? So that's the unboxing. If you are yet to subscribe to my channel, do subscribe, hit the subscribe button and turn your notification bell on. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to share, like, and put in the comment section what kind of videos you want me to air, what you think that um, will delight you and you want to hear me share with you. Thank you so much for watching. See you in my next vlog. Kisses.